guys welcome to data entry in SPSS part 2 so I have already told you that how we have coded the data in SPSS and uh, we already created a file I have already explained part 1 uh, how I have made this file I have how I have created this and uh, how we have assigned the values and uh, now you can see the names of the variable at the top of uh, the spreadsheet of SPSS now we are going to enter the data from a questionnaire and here we have a filled questionnaire this cross means the respondent has chosen for this particular option so in gender is chosen for male and we already assign one to male so here we are going to write to one for the age he has uh, he has selected for uh, 31 to 35 and we have assigned it three so three and then in the constructs performance expectancy for one for performance expectancy one PE one he has responded for N and we have assigned three so this is 3, again this is 3 and uh, here he has chosen for A for agree, 4 and again here 4, so 3, 3, 4, 4 so let's enter 3, 3, 4, 4 and then for effort expectancy uh, agree so four then strongly agree I four five so four five four five you can enter here four five four five and then for eyes value he has chosen for three and four and the five five so three four five five three four five five in the same way we are going to enter the data for behavioral intention and this is three four 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 so Three, four, four, four. So in the same way, we are going to enter the data for all our collected questionnaires one by one. And uh, like we have for, uh, for your example, we have entered the data for one respondent. You can uh, enter the data for all the respondent. You have collected the questionnaire. So that's all for uh, this video. In the next part, we will go to the analysis. Thank you for watching our video. Please subscribe and like and comment for our video.